Hi everyone, and welcome to Cactus Facts with Park Ranger JJ. I'm a Park Ranger. <laughs> and a Power Ranger. As you can see, what we are standing in front of right now is the saguaro, the saguaro, that's the correct pronunciation, the saguaro cactus. This one is three million years old. Wait, do you want me to do real facts or fake facts? This one is very old and has reached maturity. A saguaro cactus, they only grow like one inch per year. So when you see one this tall, that's definitely like over 100 years old. And they, once they start growing their arms like this, that's when they've reached maturity. Not all of them grow arms, but most of them do. So if you see kind of the shorter ones without arms, that's just a teenager. In point two miles, turn right to Camino del Mar. Did we illegally park? Yeah. But we're ready. We're out here. Pretty busy. Double parked on the street so we can come get a sandwich. Turcado sandwich. Kettle chips. Two empty cups, which that's JJ's doing. And we're going back to Steve Harvey, so asking for cups was wasteful. We'll report back once we get these sandwiches because we are double parked, so we're probably gonna have to eat at Steve Harvey. Let you know how the sandwiches. Sandwiches in Steve Harvey while we people watch. This is a nice little strip of of business. Yeah, good bus good business strip. <laughs> Look at this. When we're looking for places to live, I usually go, what's the business strips look like here? Over under the Steve Harvey got a ticket. Um, I'm gonna say no ticket. I'm gonna say no ticket. I think there was also a, a mini emergency at the end of the street, so yeah, looks like everybody was distracted. That's where everybody was. Yeah, everybody's distracted. Uh, hopefully everybody's okay. Maybe people aren't paying attention as far as tickets go. Yeah. Pretty good cross section. Mm-hmm. I go less le less lettuce. But pretty good. There is a farmer's market on the beach. Like we're walking towards the water right now to go to a farmer's market. That's crazy. Right up our alley. Right up our alley. Beaches, well, beaches are right up your alley. I think farmer's markets is a, is a bit of both of us. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but no. the bougier the farmer's market, the better. That's up both of our alleys. Oh, love a bougie oh, farmer's oh, market. Someone where they let you sample the honey? Yeah. She's cold. Here we go. We're going up. Oh, I thought it was on the water. Oh yeah, baby, you gotta get some booty pants. Some booty pants? These are booty pants. The internet has deemed those booty pants. I don't know about those from you, Maybe like one of these. I mean, that's actually pretty good. I would say the green one. Would you like this v-neck cut better? Yeah, because it shows a tattoo. Guns and tattoos. How do I look? Good. Hello. Hi, how are you? Good, how you guys doing? Pretty good, how are you? All right. Maybe they have a lemonade here. Let's get some lemonade. But if you wanted that, she could make it. You got cash? No, but I think I'll get some. I'd run up that hill for you. I guess we should bring OC something, maybe. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. He has a house full of people. So I guess we should see him first. See what he wants. Oh, yeah? Ooh, yeah. 
Beach behind us. Hill in front of us. Uh, I'm not looking forward to this hill. Also, I didn't like how I just came in real hard with that beach. Beach behind us. <clears throat> so we hit the farmer's market. We walk down and love looking at houses. Looking at other people's houses. Like this one. Very nice. Very nice little beach house. I like this gate. Here's the plan. We've gotten lunch. We hit the farmer's market. We walk to the beach. We're gonna go to my friend O.C.'s house, hang out for a bit. I guess give him a tour of Steve Harvey because he's not seen Steve Harvey in person. We're gonna probably go get tacos tonight. Again, going back to the beach. And then I have two shows. So we're gonna climb this hill, this San Diego Everest, and then Probably can't even hear us, but I should have bought a mic. I should have wore a mic. Uh, so the thing they get is a surf and turf, and I got a surf and turf. And I asked for Jess Shrimp, and she was like, uh, "You gotta add carne asada." So it's carne asada, shrimp, and a burrito. You got a beardy taco. Say it louder. I don't know if I crushed it. I think I did pretty good. Mediocre. Impartial judge right here. He definitely crushed it. What do you think? Of what? The good. show? Yeah. It was dope. Oh, you? You were good. You were good. What do you think the whole show as a whole? <laughs> it was high. The whole show, it was high. But yeah. I only came here for you though. <laughs> he was at my very first comedy show, which wasn't supposed to be a comedy show. We used to play poker together. And there was a bar that we would play poker at. And we went one day and lost real bad, real bad. Real and quick. Real quick. Walked in, lost everything. And then we were like, and we told everybody we'd be back around 
nine. <laughs> it's seven thirty. We got time to kill. Yep. So uh, I got on stage and it was bad. That shit was bad. That shit was bad. It was bad. Terrible. You shouldn't let drunk people do open <laughs> Oh, I was still drinking. Oh yeah. Oof. And uh, I quickly quit. Drink it. Ow. I need you guys to make it out right now for Courtney Spiritual! I am still on East Coast time. I feel like it. I've been up late, but I've not been out this late. 10.30 uh, hit and your boy was uncontrollably yawning. Hell yeah, I got that yawn on camera. How you feeling? Sleepy. JJ don't be out here this late. OC might be. He look like he be vibing, but you don't got... Okay, same. They told me that second show was gonna be a bit tighter. A bit tighter. They were a bit tight. They were very tight. Are you joking me? That part was not giving your jokes the love they deserve. It might have been me. It wasn't. No, it wasn't. <laughs> okay, that's good to hear. It's weird that the later crowd would be tighter. Right. It's usually the early crowd and then they loosen up. Crazy. I'm about to say, Cheeks is getting clapped in the parking lot. Awesome. We're a bit all over the place today, honestly. It was, it's shaping out to be a day that we did not expect. So I'm kind of like running shooting with the camera. It's like a run and gun just because it wasn't as organized as some of our other days have been. That farmer's market was really good. We got two types of cheese, a goat cheese and a harder Parmesan lactose intolerant and then we got some frites frites were fire and some bows didn't really get up oh about to roll my ankle didn't really get a lot of that on camera um just because we're with fam and you know can't you can't just be putting the fam on cam <laughs> so now it is natural history museum and we're gonna go see a double feature first one is going to be Sorry. about sharks which wasn't gonna be the plan, but we're gonna go see the sharks. And then the next one is about fungi, which was the plan. We watched Last of Us recently. I know we're a bit behind, but it was the, the thing, the thing that caught our eye. So San Diego Natural History Museum. I wanna live in San Diego. I didn't know. This is the first time we've gotten to a city where I'm like, yeah, I could, we could live here. Property is pretty much the same as New York, honestly, like property value. So, yikes, but let's get into it. Smells like a school in here. Yeah. Yeah. It's embalmed. Have you ever been here before? 
Yeah, we gotta check out the museum. That's actually pretty packed. Um, I think we should get down there in the center. Good doggy. Look at this. It's a shell fossil with like the um, ammonite crystals. Isn't that cool? A shell fossil with ammonite crystals? Oh yeah. This is what I want to see right here. Golden Eagle. I don't understand this. This antelope. Why is it in a bag? I mean, see, this is why I want a dinette in the RV. This is exactly why I want a dinette. This is actually pretty cozy for a museum Airstream. It's pretty cozy in there. I should scare the shit out of That snake? I won't mind the noise stuff with that I did not expect the ladder, but here we go. Oh, yeah. <sighs> Got yeah, it. You gotta have those three points of contact. Who fits through here? really testing how big of a boy I am I'm a big boy these narrow passages and I'm trying to climb with my phone as I'm sliding whoa whoa and now I'm good yeah whoa okay that was not hard but 
pretty hard. It's very narrow as JJ comes out. <laughs> Crawl out of that hole. You can do it. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for tuning in. Thank you guys for subscribing. If you do subscribe, if you don't subscribe, still thank you. Check in if you can, please leave a comment. We, we really, really appreciate every set of eyes that we have on these videos. Like we always say, at the end of the day,